Yes, it does. That's nice. Just a little bit cut off at the bottom. Sure. We won't have a fight over that, will we? So if you've not seen this, this is one of my favorite ones. Very similar to the first game I played today. Uh, I, I suspect it's the exact same engine. And here's, here's a factoid about this game. This city that we're playing in here is Metro City from Final Fight and Street Fighter. This game is the future of Street Fighter. Cadillacs and Dinosaurs was actually a 90s comic and cartoon series. So there's plenty out there to find out about it if you want it. And uh, by the way, I don't always just do beat em ups. It's just there are so many good ones with C in the, their title. I have to do a few. Okay, I'm not playing very well here. This is one of the later scrolling beat em ups from Capcom. So there's a lot of, a lot of shenanigans in it. Yeah! Wow. <laughs> remember correctly, yeah, I can do this. So now I'm in a giant robot. Believe it or not, now this is going to come as a great shock, so sit down, but 2010 isn't canon. Uh, Ken doesn't become a scientist. Ooh, right out of it. Actually, this is really graphically similar. I'd say it was done by the same artist. Yeah, I know. Calm down. Don't let, don't, uh, don't start hyperventilating or anything. Okay. Mac the knife. Spinny attack. Here we go. No, nope, get out of that. Don't need any of their crap. Is that, um, is that, ha, sound sample guy from Strip from uh, Final Fight, the original Final Fight? Mac the Knife. <laughs> oh, this is a dinosaur stage. They definitely just reused assets here. And that guy looks exactly like a bad guy, the knife-wielding bad guy, as well. They, they made him black, but otherwise he looks exactly the same. He, yeah, he even did that little knife flip! Then again, I kind of like it when Capcom reuse stuff. It makes me go, oh, that's cool. Skeleton ahead, yeah. Hey, Razor, what's up? Gonna be lots of skeletons. Because everyone melts when they get hit by uh, Mac the Knife. Because he's an alien with Bernie knives. Or something like that. That's why I see little puffs of air every time I stab someone. That was a bit uncool, Brenda. Let's see if she melts. No, she is. Let's kill some cavemen, that's cool, like. Just hanging out. Didn't hit me, just decided to fire him, like. There, melting! <laughs> oh, so the fat dudes in this game are little, but can breathe fire. So that's an important difference from the last one we played, where they were big but couldn't breathe fire. Captain Commander. Here's the man himself, speaking of flame. Isn't that right? He's got different elemental attacks. Yeah. Is it? And this is very similar to a, a character in the last one as well. Although he looks much beefier in this. Ooh, nice dive kick. Oh. Okay, I need to get that before I die. 
See that resource management? I'm no noob. Kimbo knives, yeah. Look at this. I mean, he's clearly Blanco. Why is he gonna. Oh, I know. Maybe, because this is set in the future of Street Fighter, maybe he's Blanco's clone. Did you ever think about that? <laughs> you got the tech. Ah, yeah. oh, brown bread. Oh, I was gonna use. Oh wow, this guy's aggressive. Wow, he's not letting me hit him at all. Ah, uh, put myself in the corner. Never put Doomy in the corner. Ginzu the ninja. And this is definitely an edited sprite I've seen in many Capcom games too. Oh my god! I don't recall this guy ever giving me this much trouble. Like the sun does have a gun. So, son of a gun, son of a, son of a gun, son of a gun, yeah. This isn't, uh, this is a really good scrolling beat em up, but I wouldn't say it's my favourite one from Capcom. That's probably Aliens vs Predator. Which I still have never streamed, so... If I keep on doing this this solo streaming thing, I might keep that for an anniversary or something like that, you know, or I might do a lean. If 85 million people follow me on, on Twitter, I'll, I'll do Aliens vs Predator. At the moment, I'm really just doing these for the crack. And for content, it's good for the YouTube channel, you know? Ah! Mardia. Uh, yeah, I was actually really good at ADP. I used to be able to one credit in the arcades. No way I could do it now, but like uh, I used to have people watching me because people couldn't believe it. But you know when you're when you're really young and you don't have much to do and you just decide you're gonna do something. I was like, hey, I'm gonna master ADP. Yeah, Dino used to watch me streaming years ago, and uh, we did bond quite a bit over our love of Capcom Brawlers, and uh, we both love Streets of Rage 2 immensely. And then he then he got really upset because me and Lee streamed Streets of Rage 2 together. And he's there like, how did I miss this? <laughs> Yeah, AVP even has commands like Street Fighter in it. It's such a complex brawler, and it's so much fun. It's beautiful, and uh, it's just... Like, even the character designs in it that aren't actually aliens or predators, like Lin Kurosawa, they should be back. I have no idea why Lin hasn't been in, a, in an MVC game yet. Although I can't remember the dude's name. There's like a cyborg dude with a gun arm. Now, I know why they've never re-released that or done a sequel, but man, it'd be a good one. Oh yeah, I've got my hit stun causing air, air attacks back, because I didn't have that in Cadillacs and Dinosaurs. Oh, no look. <laughs> yeah, he wasn't too happy about that. This reminds me of Final Fight, you know, when you get you have to fight the Andores. Oh, cut in half. Yes. Yamato. Baby! So, the brawler in this game's a baby. Oh, ouch. Okay, I'm not doing great here. 
Yeah, yeah. Oh. I actually think baby's a bit crap. But I do like climbing into a giant robot in a baby in a giant robot. Oh, no hit stun for you. I play Cap and uh, Ginzu in this. <laughs> yeah, I'm well known for my hate of babies in general, you know? It's alright, I love the anime community. Almost as powerful as Hagar. Not quite, but getting there. Shit. Thanks for doing that, dude. Circus, circus, circus. That's an actual place in Vegas, isn't it? Circus, circus. Saxophone or gun? Oh my god, I'm so bad! Just wasting ammo. <laughs> oh, there's gonna be like 15 robots here, isn't there yet? Oh, let me on one of them! Why didn't I get in the bloody robot? No, it's a dead Mac. Oh wow, I just got locked in there. Jump. Get in the bloody thing. Thank you. The brawler that made you think. <laughs> There's a, lot, there's a lot of genetic manipulation going on in the games I've been playing today, isn't there? Maybe I'll do a thing like Red Letter Media where I look like for like hidden teams I wasn't expecting within all of the games that I play. Although mainly it's been lift levels, train levels, and fat dudes who either run... And I'm saying this is a fat dude. Fat dudes that either run or breathe fire or do both. That seems to be in nearly every game, arcade game I've played so far. <laughs> you know, maybe they've had a long day. Or maybe the guys I'm actually fighting are the dickheads who they all secretly want to die like. Oh, okay. Blank of all. Didn't even hit him once. Just set him on fire. Blank of all beats fire. Someone's health in. Is he gonna wake up with ball again? No. Yes. <laughs> no. Oh. Yeah, told totally used the ray gun. Making good use of those super turbo uh, lightning and fire effects, aren't they? <laughs> Fat guy's hitting fires, Rich Evans. That's not what I meant, but very funny. Oh, here we go. And there's always, there's always a vehicle level. Because of turtles in time. This is so close, because isn't there a level in Turtles in Time where you're, uh... Oh, my god. Uh, 
Ah, the final fight. Uh, barrel breaking sound. Leader bonus. I was the only one playing, dude. Got 40 seconds to do what? Okay, that that's that's not good. I just also missed the gun. Okay, I got him. Just a bit. Aquariums. Because that's what I think of when I think of Mortal Kombat. Let's kill me some fish! I always feel like I'm cheating when I use a special move, like an invincible special move. You know the ones that use health? I feel like you should know a way out of every situation. And like, arcade games, they're made to drain money off you, so there isn't a way out of every situation. Oh! Okay. Oh, uh, frozen. Oh, I tried the super there. Special even. Ninja. Oh, turn around! Stupid... <laughs> they deliberately make the controls on the robots kind of dull in this. And you're not turning around on the first frame. You can actually see the animation as he turns. Oh. Let's go, Bob. Oh yeah, the alien dudes. I forgot about them. Is there like, so what kind of bad guys can we make? How about we take an alien, only it's a human, in an alien suit? In a game with actual aliens. See if I can... baby head. He's not even called baby. Whoa, yeah! I wish he had the Hagger's voice sample when he does the spinning pile driver. That's just a pile driver, actually. I don't know why an aquarium would do that. I'm so bad at this character. It's... Oh, being slow is just so bad in this game. I bet you, like, for speed strats, he's the best or something. Because his damage output is high or something like that. Oh, my God. And that's that for baby. Last time. <laughs> that didn't work well, did it? Druk? Let's see the guy's name. Druk and Strom.
I mean, these guys are way easier than the, the one on his own. <laughs> ah! I tried to jump. Didn't get it in time. Captain. Commando. Oh, you can jump in and out of the screen. That's good to know. Oh. When in doubt, just special. What if the aquarium is holding a HR Geiger cosplay? That's a good point. Have you ever known an aquarium to hold a HR Geiger cosplay competition? So, superhero fighting ninjas. Actually, that's perfectly normal. Wolverine does it like every other day. Chocolate, yay! one side. That's what I like. And here comes a couple of lads to ruin it all. All on the one side. Especially you, Mr. I have a gun. Ooh, jump kick. Nice. No, scroll off screen. Oh, I got one. Sorry, sorry. Sorry, lads. All right. Did you punch an arrow? Yes. That's how hard Captain Commando is. He can punch arrows. Man, these things are so specific. So, yeah, there's a lot of, like, alien in this game. That they just yoinked. Oh, didn't enjoy fighting those two last time. <laughs> Set my fire. Again, their AI seems to be much calmer. Oh. Maybe they just calm it down when they're the uh, mid-level boss. Dead. I don't know if they're supposed to be like golems or robots or. Oh! Vomited on me. Lovely. Oh no! Get thrown. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's go, Genzu. Let's mess some shit up. Yeah. Actually, I think that actually was a Hagger voice sampler. Ooh. 
at this dude. He looks very, very, um, Punisher. Train level! Wow, okay. Okay, calm down. Calm down, Cobblecog. Yeah, it's a train. It's one of my... It's one of my, uh... One of my things in these games. Alright, let's see if Baby can do anything. I mean, I don't think so, but, like... <laughs> hey, I hit him. It could be... A, it's a train, dude. Look at it. It's, we're on a train. Don't be defending Capcom. They were like, we need a stage. Oh, uh, no, train. We only put them in the last five scrolling fight beat ups we've got. Like, Final Fight had a bus. No, I had a train, yeah. Ooh, people's elbow. And I try throwing. Ah! Oh, that's what you get for trying to throw someone. Ouch. Just die. <laughs> Even if it's not a train, I think on the top of a moving vehicle stands as the stereotype. Din -din 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 -din. Sounds like a song. I mean, obviously it is a song. It sounds like a song I recognize. Barracuda. Hey, Nakatomi, what? We just... We did... That is a very good point. We have just taken the train to space. And uh, that looks like a galaxy out the window. So it's not even like... We're not in low orbit or anything. We're in space space. So uh, thank you for taking this trip with me. And uh, we should all find out what train that is. It's a space train. I was trying to contract that into something, but I just realized if I do that, it's Spain. Ah, oh, buddies. I think there's an elbow drop too. Ah. Oh, Bro, Mac. That also just used the Ryu theme there. It went. Dun, 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 dun. Thanks for doing that while I said that, guys. Ooh. Seriously, with the Xenomorph cosplayers. hard with those guys in the corner there. Okay, got you all there. Oh. Mwah. Captain Commando. The voice actor sounds so disinterested that says their names like yeah, Captain Commando. Lift! Lift level! Lift level with fat fire breeders!
What's this do? I've forgotten this dude. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. He's actually called Doppel. That's great. Oh, I've got buddies. Okay, two doppelgangers. Ooh. Ah, got me on your side. Okay, so the AI wakes up with a jump attack. Come on! Ooh. I already thought I was dead. Special implement time. Oh, get bodied! Yeah, okay, you need to keep them both on one side. Oh, he took like 80%. It's done for you, son. Oh, God. Just useless lump. What's he gonna do? He always wakes up with a jump kick. You know that, Brian. Oh, I got them. I got you. Finish level, baby. Yeah. One could argue that wasn't a, a great move, but you know. Maybe just stay in your super powered form, like. <laughs> the double duple. Very good. So he kicks and expl- oh, I don't know. Organo. Cardle. Come here, Cardle. He has to manage to cut the ninja in half. This is true. <laughs> Space bridge. Not just a bridge. Not just a- Oh, sorry. Oh. Space Bridge is from Transformers, Brian. Space Lift. Look at the size of that dude. Again, are they not, like, concerned about me beating up all their boys? Oh, the dude from the first stage. Are we in Boss Rush territory? It's also looking quite rich here, which usually means you're approaching the end of the game. Robots in disguise. More than meets the eyes. Accidentally pick baby twice. This bit doesn't sound like Transformers. That's it. It's just making it, making it go long. Look hurt, painy, hurtful. I believe this is the end of game, boss. Memory serves, and I also believe he's hard to beat, even with infinite credits. He is some flavor of a dickhead. He's basically Gil.
<laughs> okay. Stay calm, bro. Remember your video and staying calm. Oh, I hit him! I hit him! <laughs> I hit him twice. Yes, yeah, scumbag slide. What a name, eh? Very good. Nice reference. Yeah, if I was working for a guy called Scumicide, I'd definitely be there like, am, am I sure about this? What is he doing to me? Okay. Hit him. Hit him twice. Let's go, cop. Well, actually, if you think about it, scum aside means he kills scum. And depending on what your definition of scum is, but most people don't think scum is a positive thing. So the removal of scum, be it dirt around the bath or whatever, might be a good thing. Same. Oh my god. Run away. Okay, I'm gonna try up and down to dodge this dude. That yeah, actually worked. Oh, okay. Didn't work that good. Oh, oh, we're down to health bar. Imagine how annoyed you've been in an arcade after spending all of this money on this dude. Ginzu the ninja. Good guy, a bit of a creep. <laughs> I don't know. We'll have to check with him. He has a monitor that's staring at dudes all the time. Yeah. I mean, ah! Baby. Is baby gonna kill him? After all my moaning, baby gets the kill. Baby head. You little. Baby. Uh. Yeah, get shagged. <laughs> hey, Aggie, what's up? Konomi. Hmm. So, that was Captain America and the Avengers. Cadillacs and Dinosaurs and Captain Commando. I think you just, you just came in right at the end. Like, <laughs> I'm heading off now. <laughs> That's that. Alright guys, it's been real. Ugh. Baby, yeah, Baby just saved the world after all my moaning about him. He's the one who did the job in the end. Uh, 
Thanks, Chris. All right. Uh, unless I'm doing anything else, I'll probably be back on tomorrow and I'll do D. So, all right. Cheers. Talk to you later.